Oh, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> what happened there? Yeah. <laughs> that was somebody's wall, I think. Um, okay, we're going to make a start. I'm just going to turn my screen off, and uh, hopefully you can see something interesting. Um, can everybody see that okay? Um, yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, this is the theme for tonight. Uh, we're not going to talk too much about the Moulin Rouge. It's just going to be a little bit of a, a theme where we're concentrating our English on. So um, I did put a video on the um, the invitation just for the people who weren't sure what the Moulin Rouge was. Um, I know Marco had a look at the video. What did you yeah. think of it, Marco? Oh, uh, I, I, I see the, the video. Yeah. Sorry. What did you, What did you think of the video or the Moulin Rouge? No. Oh, um, ah, the video. Yes. Uh, the, the video is very fantastic. <laughs> uh, I remember uh, a great movie. Uh, you, are you talking about uh, the movie, right? Uh, John? Yeah. Well, I, I put I put a video on the actual invitation as well. Ah. Um, okay. Oh, sorry. Also, sorry. No. No. But uh, also, yeah, the uh, film no, as well. Uh, I thought uh, uh, you were talking about uh, the movie uh, on uh, the Moulin Rouge. Uh, yeah, yeah, I saw the, the video in uh, your uh, blog, and uh, that's very, very interesting because uh, that, uh, that video showed uh, like uh, in that atmosphere in the Moulin Rouge and the very fantastic uh, uh, ballet and uh, very very uh, intimate uh, uh, atmosphere mm, and uh, I woman. think uh, uh, yeah 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 <laughs> <laughs> nice w women uh, but uh, also the um, uh, other other situation uh, like a ballet or or uh, yeah. similar uh, stuff right. no no that's very very interesting and and, and uh, Louis, Louis, uh, you also saw the video you're seeing here. What did you think of the uh, Moulin Rouge? Oh, um, I I need to tell you that uh, this kind of presentation of the show uh, musical mm. I don't like too much, and so the video uh, about the presentation, the show I didn't like. But the space, uh, the in uh, the Moulin, Moulin Rouge. I don't know how to say this exactly. It's um, okay. It's a beautiful place. Like um, I think that I I want to go there one day in my life. Yes, yeah, a very beautiful uh, building, isn't it? Yes. Very beautiful. Um, hello, Maria. How are you doing? Welcome. Um, is there anybody else who knows anything about the Moulin Rouge? Who's has anybody actually been there before? Nobody? No. Does anybody know what the Moulin Rouge stands for? Does anybody speak French here? We had somebody speak yes. French. Yes, yes. Hello, yes. Uh, I speak French actually. Yes. Of course you do. I remember you said that you spoke. Yeah. Well, please tell us then. Please tell us. Uh, rouge, it's uh, red. Moulin, I think in English, it's a uh, wine mill or something like this. No? Windmill, yes, correct. Yes, very good. Yeah. And so it's red windmill, and I think it's it's a kind of no. I haven't been there. Um, I was I was in I was in Paris, but I, I never I never visited the Moulin Rouge. Okay, it sounds better when you say it <laughs> than when I say it. <laughs> it sounds more natural when you yeah. uh, when you speak of the Moulin Rouge. <laughs> you know, it's yeah. uh, I, I I've been there as well, but I didn't go inside, and uh, it looks it looks very really spectacular. Um, it looks really beautiful. Um, what we're going to do now, we're going to move forward with this um, presentation. I'm just going to um, click on my, um, just bear with me one second. Um, okay, here we go. So tonight we're going to basically talk about um, the famous painting at the Moulin Rouge um, and practice our talking in uh, present continuous. Um, and then we're going to look at prepositions of place and use this to describe where objects are in relation to one another. Does that sound complicated? No, of course not. Oh, is somebody yes. mowing the lawn? That was an awful noise. Okay, we can continue. Okay, 
Has anybody seen this famous pit painting before? No. Louis Lautrec. Louis Lautrec, absolutely. Yes. It's quite a famous picture. Um, I believe painted in 1992, about, I think. Um, so what we're going to try and do now is we're going to try and describe what we see in this picture. This is a scene inside the bar, uh, inside the Moulin Rouge. And um, as we describe it now, we're going to be talking in present continuous, okay? Um, I'm not going to sit here and, and, and tell you about the rules of, of present continuous. We're just going to basically naturally speak it. So as we do it, we'll be learning, learning it, okay? Um, so this is, the, I think, the easiest way of, of learning the, the tense. Uh, present continuous. So what we'll do, we'll look at the picture for a moment and um, would anybody like to maybe you can try Marco because you're quite good with your um, your words Marco. Would you like to just try and describe a little bit of what you're seeing there okay. as best you uh, can? I, I'll try, I'll try to describe uh, that painting. Uh, in uh, that painting we we, we see um, uh, they, they, they are sitting uh, uh, in the chair, uh, the, the men and the women, uh, they probably, uh, they are drinking uh, maybe a little gla a glass of, uh, of wine, of uh, alcohol, I don't know, yes. but uh, uh, probably they are chatting uh, uh, one uh, one another, and they uh, are having uh, a nice uh, conversation all together. And probably uh, at the same time, they are uh, listening, uh, maybe to the uh, music uh, or the concert uh, uh, around uh, around there. Very good. Excellent. I, I won't make you. I won't. You won't have to say much more than that. That's very good. Excellent. Okay. And you were saying, and you were speaking in the present continuous. You were saying they yeah. were sitting. Yeah. They were. They were drinking. They were talking. Excellent. Very good, um, Marco. Um, <coughs> Thanks. Armin, Thanks. would you like to have a little go and just describe what you can see there? Um, whatever you'd like to, to, to talk about the picture. Yeah, me. Um, yeah, some some yes. people. Some people are sitting in the chairs and playing the calls and drinking the alcohol and uh, besides the girls dancing with the, on, on the music and some people uh, playing the card and talking to each other. Excellent. Thank you very much. Very good. Uh, Louise, would you like to have a little go at just uh, describing what you can see there? Um, what I see here is that um, have lots of people uh, wearing a exuberant clothes and they are, to me, they look uh, um, be there just to, uh, you know, uh, be social. And um, in the painting, in the painting, uh, I can see that uh, the air in the in that place is uh, uh, um. Mm, uh, is like I, I have a comfortable air, like you, you said. Uh, they they ha they can talk uh, to each other and uh, have conversation. Is this yes. to me? Very good, excellent. Thank you. Okay, um, moving forward. Okay, so we got a couple of questions here. Um, somebody is making. A lot of noise. I'm not sure who it is. Uh, I think it's Maria. I was going to. Yes, it's Maria. Maria, if you can hear me, um, if you can just mute your microphone for me, please, until you want to talk, because we're getting a lot of feedback from your microphone. Okay. Um, okay, Tony, um, would you like to try and um, describe <laughs> what, what the people are wearing? Yes, uh, I, I try to, to describe the picture, but my problem is that uh, I can see the picture right now. Uh, okay. Can you put the picture on the screen to, to talk about, about it, please? Can you see better now? Can you see this? No. 
You can't Only see I can see your your photo. Yes. Okay. I, I I don't know what's the problem because mm. uh, I saw I, I the picture. Perfectly. Yes. Okay. I I I. Sorry. <laughs> I can I can I can describe uh, mm. about the picture, but I memorize the the picture. If you want, I can describe something that I I saw. Okay. Uh, uh, there was there uh, the, uh, there is uh, a lot of people sitting in the in the room, mm. and they are uh, they are talking each other. Uh, they 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 are wearing uh, long sh dresses. Uh, in this case, logically, in the in the women. Yes. And the every everybody every man, uh, I think they 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 were sorry. They they are we uh, wearing a, a big hat. Very good. And yeah. they are talking about uh, something and. I think they they are staying in a party, mm -hmm. and they are. I I can remember. No, that's good. Very good. You you described it very well, in fact. So if, if you do not have memory, that's a very good memory that you have. Uh, yeah, the, the the clothes basically the ladies are wearing. Um, like you said, long, long, thick dresses, and and the gentlemen are wearing um, uh, overcoats or cloaks Cloak. and and tall hats. Yes, um, very good, excellent. Thank you. Um, I think um, both Tony and Marco have mentioned the people at the table. Um, would um, Savi? Would you like to have a go at um, what you think the people are doing at the table? Yeah, for me. Uh Seem, it seems uh, that they are uh, talking uh, each other and uh, they are uh, drinking, probably. Excellent. They are. I think. I think so. Yeah, I, I agree. They must be drinking something rather nice, wine or maybe some whiskey or yeah. something like that. Uh, yeah. Maybe Excellent. wine, maybe water. Uh, or <laughs> <laughs> yes, is it water? <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't think it's water. <laughs> <laughs> maybe wine, wine. milk. <laughs> maybe milk. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing French people, I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, it should be, it should be uh, rosé. I'm sure it's going to be. I don't know how you call it in English. Yeah. Uh, well, okay. It's not, it's not with wine, and it's like, it's like pink. They call it rosé because it's coming from the word pink. Yes, rosé. Yes, that's what we call it, rosé. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Very good. Okay, that was very good. Thank you very much. Um, an interesting question here. What are the two women at the back uh, doing? Uh, who would like to answer this one? Uh, Maria, would you like to have a go at answering this question? Sorry, can you enlarge again the the picture, please? I can. I cannot see. Yeah, I cannot see clear. Okay. Um, just give me a second. I'll just have to do a little oh, bit of magic no here. Um, uh, my magic's not working. Yeah, okay. What I'll have to do, I'll, I'll, I'll go back to this. I'll go back okay, like that, you thanks. see, then you can. Okay. okay. So, um, yeah, the question being, uh, what do you think the two ladies at the back are, are doing? Um, yeah, who would like to have a try answering this? Um, Sarbit, Sarbit, can you... Um, oh yes, sorry Maria, yes you can say, you can say it Maria. <laughs> <laughs> of course you can, we can't hear you, so you can un unmute yourself and you can, you can tell us. Uh, hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, the, the, the answer was what are the two women at the back doing? Uh, one woman is, is speaking and the other uh, a woman is touching her, 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 her. <laughs> yes. I think, I think. Well, I mean, there's no right or wrong answer. We don't know what they're doing, but it's just, you know, it's just you trying to describe. And that was very good. Yes. Um, anything else you'd like to mention about them? Yes. They are yes, um, I know this kind of picture uh, painting uh, 
has lots of movements. Um, I, I studied it in my high school and I think they are dancing because I took the picture in Google because to see larger mm -hmm. and one of the women uh, have have like a, 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 sh a shadow, shadow, how to say this word? Um, you know, um, how to say this? Shadow. Uh, uh, have two shadow, okay. Have mm -hmm. a shadow close her, so mm -hmm. probably she she's doing a movement in the picture, in the mm -hmm. painting. She's making a movement, so you think she's moving, yes? Yes, yes? yes I think she's dancing. Okay, um, just one thing to... Um, uh, to say uh, about Louis, uh, Louis, sorry, um, it's uh, when you say uh, plural women, it's uh, women. You don't have to say women's. There's no s at the end of it. Just so yes, you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, it's you have to apologise. I just want you to know that was all. Just want you to be aware of that. It's no, it's no problem. Yeah, um, that's why you're here to learn. Uh, so. As in front of all words in plural. Sorry. It's fine. It's no problem. <laughs> I'm just trying to uh, help you with your with your English. So, um, excellent. Thank you for that. That's that's interesting. Uh, anybody else want to um, try and have a go at describing what they could be doing? Uh, what about the lady with her hands in her hair? What do you think she's doing? Is she dancing or is she just trying to um, put something into her hair? Does anybody got any ideas? Maybe. Anybody? <laughs> she's yeah, showing her yeah, her haircut. She's showing her. Yeah, she may be talking about about the cut that. Oh, a haircut, that of course. Had on. Absolutely, yes. Yeah. Hair. Good, excellent. Oh, Maybe. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Should be. <laughs> yeah. Good, Marco. Did you Ma were you about to say something? Ma the are you talking about uh, the the woman uh, in the first sight? No, in in the in the in the full in the, behind at the back with the uh, with ah, the, the red back. hair. Ah, yeah. the yeah. Two, the women. Uh, maybe they they are dancing, but uh, also they could uh, uh, moving to towards uh, other table. Maybe uh, maybe they want to uh, meet uh, other people uh, they we uh, can see in this uh, painting, mm -hmm. and they are moving towards uh, other uh, <laughs> table, or other friends. Good. <laughs> Maybe they are making a gossip. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe gossiping. <laughs> I'm sure well, if they're women, I'm, I'm sure if they're women, they are gossiping about something. I'm pretty sure you're right there. <laughs> <laughs> does anybody know what gossiping is? Can you anybody explain? Oh, sorry, I'll say. Does anybody not know what gossiping means? Anybody? Uh, Do you all, I don't know. You don't know. Anybody else? I, mean, I not don't honest? know. Okay. Um, does anybody want to try and uh, explain the word gossip? Gossip is uh, uh, gossip is no. talking about uh, I don't know how how to say in English. Maybe gossip. Uh, uh, in my opinion, gossip is um, talking about someone, about their life, behind about this their style. Yeah, yeah, behind the. Oh, okay. I understand now. Oh, I know this word. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's just it basically means it's it's like small talk, really. It's it, it's like yeah. uh, not important things. Um, it can be yeah. uh, negative things. Mm -hmm. It can be talking about somebody yeah. behind their back. Mm -hmm. um, it could just be about what they've been doing uh, at work or what, yeah. what they did last night. It's just general uh -huh. chit chat, really. So Espe especially uh, yeah. gossip uh, is when uh, uh, we are talking about. Uh, 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 the, the the VIP, uh, the important person, or the star, the, the movie star, the player, yeah, the star, or, yeah, yeah. or or famous uh, famous people, and they are uh, showed on the magazine. Uh, there are uh, a particular uh, <laughs> magazine or newspaper. Mm -hmm. They are talking about uh, always about the gossip, the the pr private life, uh, what uh, yeah. what uh, they are doing in their life. And, uh, absolutely, they actually sell magazines uh, yeah. just about gossip. Yeah, absolutely, gossip magazines. That's yeah. and they're, they're very common in the, in the UK. Yeah. Uh, gossip Hello, there, hello, there are, absolutely, uh, yes, hello. Yeah. yes. Yeah. Okay, very good. Uh, nobody seemed to have any problems there, so we'll move forward to the next question. Um, what are the two men at the back mm. doing? Okay, mm. and I'll move back two to the big men. picture for you. There we go. Um, okay. 
I guess they're talking about. Um, can you yeah. see my mouse, by the way? Can you see my my pointer? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah I guess they're talking about yeah. these two guys here. Okay. Um, it's too difficult. Uh, let's have a look. <laughs> Who hasn't spoken? Um, I, Medi, I don't know. Would you like to try and explain what you think those two guys at the back are doing? The two men. Uh, they are just sitting. <laughs> they're they're what sitting. Are they doing? No, no, no. What are they doing? I don't know. Uh, one person is sitting in the table, uh, in the <laughs> chair, and one person is stand. Uh, I think is uh, in the hotel somebody is waiting. That is the doing is waiting job. Okay. And, uh, yeah. and one one person is sitting, and the the waiter is came in, in the table and asked something. What do you want? Mm -hmm. Maybe. Good. Maybe they are playing a piano, but I cannot see the piano. <laughs> <laughs> No, but they—they they both seem to be staring at something, don't they? They so—they're both looking yeah. at something. Um, yeah, yeah, something, yeah. Something. Uh, maybe we are uh, seeing only a little part uh, of the entire uh, lounge, uh, the entire hall. Uh, of course. Mm. Uh, maybe in uh, uh, the back, in the background, uh, there are another uh, large part, and the other two men uh, probably mm. they are. Um, Talking to other people, or they are doing uh, uh, other things, uh, and nothing to do with the the men and the women in the first sight. Mm. I think this is the beauty of this this painting. It just it just gives you a very small snapshot of what is obviously yeah. a very large room, and uh, it, it's it's quite intriguing to think what these people are all doing because there's so many different characters in the painting, and they all <laughs> seem to be doing different things. Um, so it's a very interesting painting. Um, I think, sorry. sorry, yes, continue. I think, yes. They've been, I think they've been talk. I think they've been talking to these two uh, women. Maybe they wanted to pick them up, but it turned it turned really bad. And these two <laughs> men, they just like uh, clean. Okay. And these two women are talking about these two men and saying, "Oh, they are not nice guys." And you could be right. Absolutely. <laughs> Everyone. Yeah, be because right. the the because the woman on. Uh, a black dress. She's mm -hmm. looking at these two men, mm -hmm. and the other woman is like acting that they are maybe they are not. Um, the the acting was really bad or something. Yeah, good point. She Absolutely. didn't like the acting. Yes. Yeah. And the two men just they they just like didn't like um, what the woman said, and they pre they are prepared maybe to to leave the the bar. Excellent. Absolutely, it's a possibility. Who knows? Absolutely. Very good. Yeah. Well said. Yeah. Now, nobody's mentioned um, this lady yet. What do you think the woman on the right is doing? The right? Um, the, 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 blind, uh, the blind woman. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. I just need yeah. to... Yeah, sorry. Just give me a second. I've just um, pressed the wrong button. This is not very easy when you have to do this screen sharing. It gets a bit yeah. complicated. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. We know that. <laughs> okay, um, so I'll go back to the big picture so we can have a look uh, there. Okay. Okay, so the very interesting lady at the front. Does anybody yeah, like her. to try and have a guess about about her? What she's doing? She's obviously looking this way, so um, she's maybe noticed the the painter. Yes. Mm. Yes. Uh, it it, it uh, she she seems uh, like. Uh, 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 to be uh, on posing, uh, they uh, she is posing uh, uh, in front of uh, uh, a photographer uh, or a, a painter mm -hmm. because uh, it uh, she seems uh, to look uh, at the eyes of the the, the painter directly. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about the the woman, uh, the blonde uh, hair. Yes. Anybody else want to mention? Um about her, she's actually um, quite an interesting lady, I believe. I think yes. she's, um, she's, yeah. I think she she's looking at the mirror herself. You think so? Yes. It's she possible. could well be. Because hmm? apparently she's um she's quite a famous lady. Apparently she's actually one of the um, entertainers. 
of the Moulin Rouge, I, I believe. Um, I'm not 100% oh, right. sure, but I think she's actually quite a famous person in those in those times. Um, she was sitting in the bar, and um, um, yes, she's looking straight at the painter who's yes. who's painted in quite a dramatic way because the lighting um, was obviously down to the right, and it's cast a shadow across her face, so it looks a little bit quite almost quite scary in a way. It looks. Mm. Yeah. So, hmm. I showed this. I showed this picture to my students at school, and they were like, "Oh my God, who's that horrible lady in the corner?" <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I, I had to explain to them that it, um, she doesn't look like that. It's actually just the the lighting. It's creating the shadows on her face. So, excellent. Very good. Okay, um, we'll move forward then. So, um, this is an interesting one. Um, one of the people in the painting is the artist. Hmm. Uh. Oh, to look the track. So, which person do you think this is? So, I'll go back so we can see a bigger the picture. There we go. The mm. woman in the right. The woman. Uh, the woman. Uh, the man. The man. The man. The man. The man. The painter is a man. Well, I'll give you a clue. It's a man. <laughs> it's a man. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, I, I've got. See, can you see my point in my mouse here? Um, I think uh, the the short man. <laughs> okay. Does anybody think it's this person here? Uh, no. No. For me, it's the man in the center of the the, the picture. Do you think this person the man here? With the bird. Yeah, uh, yeah. This one here. Me too. Also, I I I think uh, it. Uh, uh, he uh, could be the the painter. This one here, Marco. Yes. This guy here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. The, the, the man is standing no, up. Me, uh, that's, 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 no, me. No, me. It's a it's a man with the, the with the black uh, black beard. Uh, this guy here. The one here. Yeah. No, nope, here. This, this no, here? at the right, at the right. He's sitting. No, the one with the, yeah, this one. That one there. He's okay, well, so you think it's well. him? Okay. Does anybody think it's this gentleman here? No. Nobody? Okay. No, no, no. Does, does anybody think it's this old gentleman here? No. No, no, no. No? no. 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 Old man. <laughs> does anybody think it's this gentleman here? The man. I think. The 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 I think so, there is this one. This one here? Yes. yes. Oh, maybe it could, yeah, could be. Yes, I think. <laughs> Because because Henry Toulouse is not is not a tall man, so yeah. Okay, I'll tell, tell us the truth. Tell us I'll, the truth. I'll tell you the truth. I'll tell you who it is. Okay, <laughs> it's it is actually this small guy here. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. She's Toulouse in the track here. Toulouse. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's the guy. I, I um, went to close. <laughs> yeah. Truth. I'm just going to yeah. mute Maria again. She's making an awful it was, noise. It was difficult to, to guess. It yes. is. It is difficult. Yeah, yeah. It's, just, it's just interesting, actually. I mean, when, when I saw the question, I didn't know who, which guy, which gentleman it was. It could have been any of them, really. But um, it's yeah. very interesting how he portrays himself because um, he, he, almost, he almost vanishes. You can't see him. He's almost yeah, lost yeah. In, in the coat of this gentleman here. So, Okay, uh, we'll go forward then. Oh my God! I think that's really difficult to describe that picture. Mm. <laughs> uh, yes, it is. <laughs> well, here we're going to speak a little bit more about uh, the, the grammar here. So, um, wh what we'll do is um, I'll choose somebody to 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 try and, and answer this question. Um, let's have a look. Um, who do we have? Uh, Medi, can you hear us? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, excellent. Would you like to? Um, Answer the question there, please. Number one, um, in the picture, the men wear or are wearing hats. What do you think is the correct answer? Um, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'm wearing. I'm wearing yes. You think I'm wearing yes? Wearing, yeah. Yes. Yes, because it's it, it, it it's um it's an action that. That um, that goes. I mean, it's in the. I mean, it's the time, and also it goes in the time. Excellent. It's happening right now, as you as you're describing. It's happening. It. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Well done. Excellent. Very good. 
Okay, um, let me have a look now. Let's see. Uh, Maria, um, would you like to try and answer number two for us, please? Uh, wait, John, so the answer, what the answer? Sorry? John, what is the answer? The answer to number one was are wearing. So in ah, the picture, the okay. men are wearing hats. That was the correct <laughs> one, yes. Okay, number because, two, Maria. Um, in uh, Britain, women yeah. often wear or are wearing hats at weddings. What do you think? Are wearing. Are wearing hats at weddings. Wear. 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 Uh huh. I don't know. Uh, okay. It's 50 50. 50 50. Wear. 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 You have what, Maria? <laughs> Come on, Maria, you got, you got to decide. It's your question. Wear, because they usually uh, wear uh, hats yeah. at weddings. It's right. It's uh, I'm going to let Maria answer this. She's looking very confused now. She's got. She yeah. doesn't know. Where, where, where? I think where because there is often. <laughs> In Britain, women often wear hats at weddings. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my God. <laughs> it is difficult. It's quite confusing. There's the answer. Where? Okay. Where? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Where? Okay. Can, okay. can you explain? John, why? Where? Yes, it's um, it's a um, it's a statement. It's yeah. just a it's present just simple statement. statement. So yeah. present. Actually, present simple I just uh, actually I just see the often the often. So I answer uh, where not are weary, but I don't know. That's a good reason. The costume. It's the habit. It's yeah. A, uh -huh. it's yeah. In Br in Britain, women often wear habit. hats. Yeah. It's a statement. It's um. It's yeah. yeah. Often uh, or often. often? Sorry. Or often. Often so or often. Usually. Often. Usually. No, no, no. Uh, how to pronounce? The pronunciation. Uh, often or often. Often. Both. Both are acceptable. Ah. Often. Often. Okay. But, um, often. Yeah. You. You. You'll quite commonly hear people in in the UK to say often. So, but, uh -huh. um, for you guys, I guess it's best you say properly often. Okay. But I, yeah, being English, um, um, we generally say often. So, okay. okay, but both both are correct. Um, I'm just going to. Sorry, I've, I've made a mistake again. I have to click back into here again, into there. There we go. Okay. Yes, um, yes. Question number three. Um, let me have a look. Oh, Nikolai, mm -hmm. welcome back. Um, yeah. Hi, Nikolai. Savi, would you like to have a go to answering number three for us? Can you see yes. the question? Mm? Yes, I can see. Great. Katrina usually uh, sits uh, at the front of the class. Yeah. Super. Yeah. Because uh, there is uh, usually. Yes, it's a fact. Yes. It's a fact, yeah. Very good. Excellent. Okay, um, let me see. Um, Nikolai, welcome back. Would you like to try number four for us? Can you see the screen? Thanks a lot. Just a little bit. Good. Take your time. Relax. Take a deep <laughs> breath. <laughs> today she sits or today she is sitting at the back? What do you think, Nikolai? Let me. I can't see anything right now. Okay. All right. Well, in that case, I'll move to somebody else who can. Just uh, let me know when you can see the the screen. Um, Tony, um, would you like to? Can you see the screen? Okay. Yes. Uh, yes. Now. Okay. Thanks. No problem. I think the answer is uh, today. She's sitting at the back. Yeah. Everybody agree? Yes, yes, yes. Anybody is, disagree? Yes. Today she For me, sitting. today she sit. Sit at the back. No, for me, today Could she is sitting at the back. Okay. Maybe if we say, maybe if we say, she is sitting at the back now, it's good. <laughs> but today maybe we can say she sits. For me, today, today she sits. Today she sits at the back. Eh. 
I love that reaction, Marco. Okay. Okay. I I try to be different. I try to be different. Oh my God. Today is Okay. Excellent. Okay. Um, excellent. Well done, everybody. That was um, that was well done. Um, what we'll do now, um, a, a lot of people um, have a have a real problem with prepositions. Um, so I thought um, we would, because we've been talking about um, um, the painting, and we've been saying um, she's at the back, he's at the front, she's to the right, she's to the left. Um, it's a good time, I guess, just to explain prepositions a little bit. So um, here we have um, a, a number of prepositions. There are more than this, by the way. This is just an ex example of prepositions. Mm -hmm. So we have behind. In fact, um, let's have a look. Um, who do we have here? Um, Nikolai, can you, can you see the screen now? Yes. Excellent. Would you yes. like to read those uh, out for us, please, if you, can, if you don't mind? Preposition. Yeah. Any beside, on, in front of, in, under, on the right, is despaired. I'm trying again. Yes. On the Between, right. Yes. In the middle. Thank you. Behind, besides, on, besides. in front of, in, under, on, on the right, on the between, mm. in the middle. Okay, so there are more than that. We're just going to have a look at these today. Um, so, uh, let me move forward. What I'm going to do now is show you uh, an image, and we'll choose somebody to have a go at describing what they see, okay, using a preposition, all right? So it's quite simple. Um, there's nothing difficult about it. Okay, um, Marco, would you like to have a go at describing um, what you see there? Okay, <laughs> I, I see uh, 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 a computer with uh, the screen, and uh, uh, behind uh, the computer, probably it is uh, a cat. Brilliant. Behind of the computer. Yes. There Excellent. Is the cat behind the computer. Yes, the cat is behind the computer. Yeah. Very good. Cat behind the computer. Yes. 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 Excellent. Simple. And cat in the front of computer. Or you can say the computer's in front of the cat, of course. Yeah. Excellent. Um, uh, let's have a look now. Uh, Louis, uh, can, can, you, can you see the, uh, the image? Yes, you there? of Hello. course I can see. OK, Hello. great. Um, Would you like to describe? I see a dog on the chair. Perfect. Dog on the chair. Simple. Very good. Yes. Okay, um, let's have a look. Who's not answered a question for a while? Uh, Shaq, have you, would you like to try and have a go at this one for us? Can you see? There is a who? Just describe the there dog if you want to. The dog, his position with, in there regards is, to... Uh, there, is, uh, there is CD between dog and tape. In the yes. radio. And That's the correct. Uh, yes. Yes. And what about the dog? Where would you say the dog is in relation to the the CD player? The dog in front of the CD player, or the CD between. There is a CD between dog and CD player, or the there is a uh, the dog. There is a dog in front of the CD player. Excellent. Yeah. Perfect. Very good. Well done. The dog is in front of the CD player, and as you pointed out, there's also a CD in between. Yeah. Absolutely, very good. Okay, um, so far so good. Let's have a look. Um, who would like to have a go at answering this one? Um, let's see. What is that, cat or dog? <laughs> cat. <laughs> it's a window. It's, it's a window or a door. <laughs> well, it's, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah, a, it's yeah. a cupboard, yeah. I think, really. Cool. Um, Mehdi, yeah, would you like to describe that one for us, please? The, the relation with the cat. The yeah, cupboard. Yes. Um, there is a cat uh, in the closet. This is a closet, yes? 
Absolutely, yes. Closet or, or cupboard. Perfect. Very good. Easy. Cupboard. Mm. Now, this one. Um, let's have a look. Uh, <laughs> Shaq, um, would you like to tell us where the cat is, please? The cat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming it's a cat. It could be a snake. I don't know, but I think it's a cat's tail. Uh, there is a uh, there is tail under the bed. <laughs> 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 okay, there is a tail. Tail. How can I say? How can I pronounce tail? There is a cat. There is a cat's tail. Oh no no no! There is a cat under the bed. There's a cat yeah. under the bed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. And um, Maria, I'm going to unmute you now so we can hear you. Um, where d w can you tell us the, the, the position of the dog, please? Ah, uh, the dog. There's dog on the bed. The dog on the bed. Or what can I say? Uh, Alpha. Al sorry. Can you let Maria answer this, please? Sorry. Um, yeah. Yeah, the, the dog on the on the bed. On the bed. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Perfect. Very good. The uh, cat and the yeah. Okay. The cat, the cat under the bed. Yes, the cat is under the bed and the dog yeah. is the dog on the bed. On the bed. Correct. Very good. Excellent. Well done. And now. Uh, who needs to answer this one? Tony. I think Tony hasn't answered one for a while. Um, let's. Um, can you tell us about the cat, please, in relation the to, the t to the TV? Yes. Yes. Uh, um, in front of the image, I think the cat. No, sorry. Uh, if I were the TV, the cat is on the right. Right. Yes, you can say the cat is on the right of the TV, <laughs> and you could also yes. say something else as well. What, would you, what else could you say? Depends. Besides. Excellent. The cat is beside yeah. the TV. Besides, um, yeah. Yes. And, and what about... Yeah, that's right. The cat is beside the TV. You can also say the dog is beside the TV, or the dog yeah. is on the right on the of right the TV. The right. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. You can. And, um, the TV is between the cat and yeah. the dog. Excellent, I was just about to ask that. <laughs> <laughs> the next question. <laughs> Shall I go home? <laughs> I don't think you need me here, do you? <laughs> Excellent, very good. Okay. Um, okay. Who would like to answer this one? Any volunteers? Mm. Uh, there is a cake on the... What? How can the Mary? Yeah, I forget the word. Can I do? The cat on the table Cupboard. and Al is beside. Yes, Louis. Yes. Um, okay. There is a cat on the case. This case, I think, the name of this. Um, and a dog beside the the case. Yes. On the right. Yes, you can say that. Or on, on the, the right. right. Yes. Right. Excellent. I think the picture is actually um, some drawers. I think. You uh, drawers. Or you can call them bed a bedside no, okay. cabinet. I think it's something uh. that goes next to the bed, but oh, it, it doesn't okay. really matter. So bedside. Yeah, bed cabinet. bedside cabinet. Yeah, because it, it, it yeah. sits other side of the bed. Yes. Mm -hmm. Very good. Excellent. I don't think anybody had any problems with that then. Excellent. Um, I think this is the final one now. Um, Nikolai, would you like to have a go again? Um, anything yes. that you can see there, you can describe to us. What is this? The bibliotheque or... <laughs> I don't know. The, the bibliotheque is between two cages. Yes, excellent. I think, yeah. it's a, I think it's a shelf, I think. Um, yeah, uh, shelves. Shelves, yeah. 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 Shelves? Can you write? Shelf. Shelf. I can yeah. write for you. Yes, of course I can write. Um, there you go. Shelves. 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 Um, so the, the shelves are in between the cats, yes. Yeah. Um, anything else that you can describe there? Can we say that uh, the shelves is in the middle of the cats? Absolutely. 
Oh, okay. Just yeah. the shelves. The shelves are in the middle of the cats. Yes. Yeah. Very good. The uh, cat is uh, the cat is between left and right side of cat of uh, shelves. Is correct? Say again, Nikolai. What what, what was that? The cats it's between uh, left and right part of uh, uh, oh. shelves. <laughs> Ooh, now you're getting complicated. It's complicated. You could, you <laughs> could <laughs> say that the, the cats are on both sides of the shelves. Uh, both, both. Both right. sides. Mm. Yeah. Both sides. Yeah, because um, if I if I show you here, these are the sides, so you can say the cats are on both sides of the shelves. Yeah, excellent. Um, have I just pressed the wrong button again? If you can see me, by the way, if I suddenly spring on the on the on the screen, it means I pressed the wrong button. So I do apologise. I have to press this again now. Oh, it's so complicated. This Google Plus. Here we go. Uh, okay. I've done it. Do you know what? I've just <laughs> <laughs> I've just done it again. <laughs> oh, do you me? All right, wait a minute. Here we go. Uh, right, I won't do that again. Okay. Now, this is interesting. Okay. What we're going to do now? Um, it's getting to the end of the of the lesson now. We, I'm, I, I have two photographs. Um, mm. Quite interesting. Well, they're actually pictures, um, should I say? And um, what I'd like two people to try and describe them to us so what we've learned today using all the things that you've come across today that you've learned um, try and um, put them into this final exercise so I'm going to show a painting now and um, I need a volunteer who would like to try and describe the, the painting to everybody else do I have anybody who'd like to volunteer who's brave enough to to have a go anybody Hi. <laughs> it's down to the it Italian stallion. Marco, my man. Yeah, okay, yeah. excellent. Thank you for um, volunteering. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is put the picture on the screen, Marco, and if you can look at the picture. Yeah. Um, oh, my God. I think Maria. I think Maria. Washing <laughs> machine. <laughs> It's a turbo washing Formula machine. Formula One. <laughs> it sounds like a rocket taking off. Okay. Probably it's Vettel. Me <laughs> <laughs> Vettel. <laughs> Very good. Um, so if you can uh, look at the painting, Marco, and describe yeah. uh, what you see as best you can, okay? Okay, I try do my, do my best. Excellent. Are you ready for this? Go. Oh, Butel. Oh. oh, very good. I was wondering who would have uh, noticed the. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, oh my God, that's smart I, man. I don't know <laughs> if uh, all of you know that uh, Botero uh, is uh, from Colombia, and at the same time they living uh, from uh, a lot of time uh, in Italy, uh, in Tuscany, in uh, near uh, where I live. Uh, uh, in uh, Pietra Santa, uh, a famous uh, uh, town where many sculptures they are living uh, right now. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Marco, can I ask you? Uh, this lady here in the blue is that um, is that yeah, um, a, a typical they, Italian lady? <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no. no. <laughs> oh my God! Yes, with the spaghetti, <laughs> no, with the pasta and spaghetti and pizza. So. <laughs> oh, no. yeah. <laughs> After a big treatment of uh, <laughs> pasta and pizza, <laughs> many many <laughs> pizzas uh, and pasta, but uh, our women they are uh, uh, nice uh, looking. <laughs> then <laughs> that women, don't worry. <laughs> if you I can uh, in Italy, you you see they are different. They are very very different, but. Uh, in, uh, all of you, you know that uh, Butero mm, like uh, to represent uh, uh, the people in their uh, large uh, aspect, mm. and uh, for um, he is uh, normally to paint uh, uh, the, the woman, uh, the women, uh, and the men uh, in that uh, uh, fat uh, <laughs> aspect. He was eating and at McDonald's. Yeah, I probably. <laughs> <laughs> they ate uh, a lot of hamburger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, 
But, um, however, <laughs> in uh, this painting, uh, Botero has represented uh, a man and uh, a woman. Uh, they are dancing, uh, and uh, probably they are uh, they uh, having a lot of fun. And uh, after uh, a lot of hour, they uh, get uh, lose uh, their weight. <laughs> I hope for them. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> so beautifully described. Yeah, yeah. Hi, Savi. <laughs> Okay, bye bye, Savi. Thank you for joining us. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, Otto. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Um, and wh what about the people? Try and describe it a little bit more in the, in the background, if you can do, um, Marco. Yeah. Uh, oh, just so we can hear. There is the flag oh, of Colombia. Yeah. We, we uh, uh, they are in a, uh, a holiday in a. Um, a room uh, where uh, they are listening uh, <laughs> nice music uh, and uh, in the, the background uh, uh, we see uh, other couple uh, man and woman uh, also they are dancing like uh, this in the first uh, sight and uh, probably they are in uh, 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 holiday in uh, in, a, in a little village, or or, or maybe no, it, it is a, it should be uh, inside a room, but uh, uh, I think uh, they should be in the past. Is uh, they are describe uh, uh, situation uh, uh, past uh, because uh, also the dress they are wearing. Uh, uh, they are thinking uh, about uh, for uh, the, the, the years, uh, the many years ago, not uh, in actually uh, times. When was uh, when was this painting um, drawn? Do you think? Do you have any idea of the dates when he was um, uh, drawing these types of paintings? Are we talking about the uh, early 1900s, 1920s, 1930s? Yeah, yeah probably yeah. The, the, this painting uh, representing uh, uh, the 50 or 60 years. Uh, okay, mm, 1950s. If, uh, I guess. Okay, excellent. Um, I can, sorry, John. Yes? Uh, I can, for example, I can describe that. For example, in the behind, there is, it's, um, the room is decorated with, with the uh, Colombian flag. Yes. You know, the color. Oh, yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. and there is a painting, and the painting it's also representing the same room. We can say like the same, uh, maybe the same door, the same color of the door, and um, and there is also, for example, the woman is um, wearing uh, the color of the dress of the woman is like um, there is stars. It's like representing the mm -hmm. the sky at night. Yes, and. There behind, we can see it's like a moon, and the two other couples in the back of the painting, they are like just like going out or, or something. Yes, it looks like there's a moon outside, doesn't it? The yeah. door's open, and it looks like there's something outside. Yeah, the door is open, and there's like a moon there, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and the dress, it's uh, and the uh, color of the sky representing stars, mm -hmm. and the blue color. Very good. Yes, e excellent. And I, and I, I think there's um, it also looks like there's a mirror on the wall in the background as well, above above the uh, gentleman's head. It looks like there's I a mirror. Or I something. thought it was a painting. I thought it was also another painting representing the same painting. You know, I was thinking oh, that. Clever. You know, yes. Or I mean. Yes. V very good. Excellent. Because I don't think that there is two doors. I mean, I, I don't know two doors in the same room. Yeah, yeah it should be. Mm -hmm. Depends. No, absolutely. Very good. Uh, other uh, interesting point, if I can uh, mm, say, is uh, uh, about uh, uh, the shape of the hair of the, the woman uh, mm. in the first uh, uh, sight. They are a strange shape because uh, in the reality I didn't see, uh, never, I never, never see that uh, shape of uh, of hair. Uh, probably is. Uh, 
uh, because uh, uh, Botero uh, like uh, uh, represent uh, the people uh, uh, in a in, in a personality way way uh, they own uh, uh, only only uh, he uh, only him uh, can uh, uh, manage uh, uh, this type of uh, form of mm -hmm. body uh, I, I don't know other li uh, other types of uh, painter uh, uh, they describe uh, the people in this uh, this shape because when I, when I look at the hair I, I see movement it, it, it almost looks yeah. like she's been spun around at some point and her hair is yeah, still yeah, in, yeah, in the probably. process yeah, of, yeah, yeah. of falling down yeah um, uh, and obviously the color the color of the hair as well it's red so it's uh, quite an unusual yeah. color um, I, I wonder where the subjects were were painted. I, I, I mean, I can see the Colombian flags in the background. It's quite interesting to see whether yeah. uh, where he painted this this painting and uh, where it's supposed to be. Because I assumed it was going to be somewhere in Italy, but uh, maybe it's not. I don't know. No, 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 no. no. You're right. You're right. Interesting. Okay, I have another one now. Um, so, anybody else want to have a go at describing the next pa painting? Anybody brave enough? Shaq. Maybe. Do you, do you feel brave enough to have a go? <laughs> I, I guess not. <laughs> uh, Tony, would you like for to have, have a go? Yes, just have a for go. I mean, it, for the next picture. Yeah, the next one. If you can, if you can see it, okay. I, yes. I'm going to put I'm going to put it up up, up now yes. for you. So. I, I'm go uh, I'm going to try. Okay, excellent. Have a go. Uh, Just have a go. Uh, okay, <laughs> the uh, the couple are um, lying in the country. Uh, uh, in behind them, there are a village, a small village. Mm -hmm. uh, I can see, I think, a small church, mm -hmm. typical in the. Uh, European European uh, countries. Mm -hmm. uh, I can see behind them also a very big mountain. I think uh, this is um, uh, in the evening. Uh, sorry, in the afternoon mm -hmm. because they have uh, some fruits in. Uh, I don't know how do you name. Basket. Ox, cesta. Basket. Basket. Yes. Right. Very good. Um, yes. Uh, next to next to the women, a uh, woman. Uh, there are um, uh, uh, glass of uh, juice. I Very think. Very good. And mm -hmm. behind them there are uh, some trees and uh, there there are they they are lion in on the grass. Uh, and Very good. Uh, and I don't know how to say <laughs> more. Very uh, good. They, oh. they, 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 he, he has a very sm uh, smart uh, shoot. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's an uh, epoch uh, time. In this, they are from Italy, I think. It's typical uh, environment like a small country in Italy, I think. Yeah, probably, probably, very you're well right. Done. Excellent, the Tony. <laughs> very well described, very good. Yeah. You described pretty much everything there very well and and correct as well. Um, extremely good. Nikolai, um, uh, would you like just to quickly have a go as well, describing um, the picture as best you can? Hello, Nikolai. <laughs> he said that he cannot. He said that he should be silent for a few minutes because. Okay, yeah. fine. Okay. Some noise. Uh, yeah. Alfath, would you like to have a go at um, trying to describe the picture for us? Okay, I will try. Uh, I think the uh, the the painting represents about uh, some uh, about two couples have a picnic. Uh, there are many. There are many mountain uh, pine the couples, and uh, <clears throat> there, uh, there, there, there are 
one, two, three, four, uh, five, uh, five fruits on the basket. Uh, and then uh, there are, <laughs> I'm so sorry, I just want to say they are, they are. And there are couples, uh, they, uh, the, the couples try to enjoy the, their picnic and the couples, uh, how can I say, um, um, <laughs> you're doing very well. You're doing very well. Uh, <coughs> Do they look happy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, no, 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 no. They are like uh, uh, the the couples are like uh, someone who who uh, I can say it, they are like uh, hopeless people. <laughs> Hopeless. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know because uh, their expression is. Uh, uh, I think they are not happy for in the in the painting, uh, in the picture, uh, and then um, hmm, how can I say? Uh, maybe the painting represent represent about the couple who cannot enjoy. Uh, who cannot enjoy with their relative? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> My God! Now you're doing very well. Excellent. I, I understand what you're saying. Very well. What I've done there, I put. Um, if you can see in the uh, the box, the right, I put fed up. Um, I think that's a good word to describe how they look. Um, they look fed up. It means they look maybe bored, um, yeah. um, not particularly excited. Um, oh yeah, bored maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Um, <laughs> I can say that it, they over the age and they're, they're trying to take a nap, and this is the the, the dessert they take the uh, uh -huh. maybe yeah, because they, they they are full. Mm -hmm. Yes, good. I don't think there's anything else really to describe. But, um, I think you described everything really. Um, Tony did a very good job uh, describing pretty much everything in the picture there. I think the only thing that nobody mentioned really was actually the um, the blanket that they were laying on. Mm -hmm. They were laying on a blanket on the grass. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Um, and that's it. Um, I've run out of things to, to show you. Uh, that was the end of the lesson. Uh, yeah. Very good. I mean, I, I'm very impressed. You've done a very good job, everybody. Um, uh, thanks, John. Thanks. Cope co co very well with that, and um, thanks. nobody, nobody seemed to have many problems really. Um, I would just su suggest that maybe, and it, it's always difficult. It's just learn plural, so it's not. Um, there's lots of mountains. There's lots of mountains. Um, yeah, and and women, not women's. Um, but other than that, you did all did very very well. Uh, I'm extremely impressed. Um, nobody had really any problems, to be quite honest with you. So, were, were, there, were there any questions at all? Anybody like to to ask um, me or anybody else while we're here? Quickly, if anybody like to ask anything, um, please do then, so. Uh, what do you mean? What do you mean with fed up? Fed up is uh, maybe. My opinion is like someone who don't who, who don't like something. Uh, fed up, fed up. I fed up. If 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 you're fed up, it means basically oh, you you don't want to be here. You you're bored. You're yeah. okay. you're, you're not really happy. Um, fed up. Fed up. Yeah, it's oh, uh, an expression up. that's. Um, yeah. You are that not we, willing to do anything. For example. Yeah, I mean, if you, if your children say you're fed up, if my, if, if my children go, Daddy, I'm, I'm fed up, it means they're bored, they want to go and yeah. do something. It's like, you know, what can we do? We're fed up, we're bored. Can you type in this result? Yeah, oh. I, I, I've typed it there on the side. If you look on the side, I put fed up. I'll do it again for you. Oh, okay. okay yeah. Nice. Yeah, fed up there. Okay. Anybody, any other questions at all? For me? Uh, I wanted to say only. Um, this my opinion uh, about when uh, um, I am the try to describe uh, a situation like uh, before, uh, because uh, um, when I, you you are to uh, when I am talking, uh, uh, it's uh, not uh, easy 
always to remember uh, the the entire adjective uh, I know because in that moment uh, uh, disappear in my mind and when uh, uh, when you are talking in uh, own language it's not easy uh, always because uh, there are many many adjectives to describe a situation and uh, sometimes uh, I repeat uh, always the same uh, I I realize then uh, after they I know many adjectives but uh, it's not yeah. <laughs> <always> easy <laughs> to remember yeah, that yeah. this is my situation sometimes yeah. I have a same I have the same problem with uh, Marco when I want to describe the painting or something like that I get uh, maybe uh, I can say I get a difficult to make a story from that